How many times have you looked at someone's Excel spreadsheet and tried to decipher that formula and you are saying this formula is simply too difficult to decipher? Now, don't judge me because this formula is pretty straightforward. But assuming that this formula is really complicated and it would be nice if this C7 is more intuitive and say sales, the column header name itself, and D7, we can replace it with comps. Wouldn't it be nice? Let me show you how you can do it. First thing first, you're going to highlight the columns that you want to name with the column header and press Control shift f3 on your keyboard and this pop-up will come up here now you're gonna have to remove these left columns like this the reason for that let's say for example if you leave it on what it does is that it will create a name for each row with claire Haley, ava and so on including this top row says that this particular column will be named as well let me show you what it's done just as a test click on ok you can see that everyone has a name the way to remove those names if you've done it accidentally is go to formula define name and name manager and in here you can find all those names that you want to work with i'm going to go ahead and delete them and keep the system and the table that i want and redo the same effort again go and highlight the column Control shift f3 but this time around i'm going to say no left column just the top row so that i have each column name with the header and click on ok and if you look at it you can see that the columns are named based on the header itself now at this point all you have to do is to get rid of it because when you start using the name all the rest of the rows will be populated let me show you what i mean by that let's say c7 you're going to say sales you can see the column is already highlighting it and d7 we're going to say comms like this press enter and you can see all the rows are automatically populated you can also execute a very clean formula like this let's say for example here's sum for the total sales you can see sales like this and press enter it will sum up all the values in the sales column